to beat the heat? Want to enjoy a tea? Hi, my name is Neely Fisher. I'm the Flexible Chef and I was super excited when Ninja reached out to me to introduce you to their most amazing innovation, the Ninja Creamy. This machine helps you customize and make your own flexible creations at home, like ice creams and sorbets, even smoothie bowls for breakfast. Their Creamify technology enables the Creamy to break down a uniformly frozen block into an incredibly smooth, creamy texture in just minutes. Healthy or indulgent, the Ninja Creamy can create frozen treats as unique as you are. The Creamy has a powerful motor base and it only takes about 90 seconds, like a minute and a half, to transform your frozen pints into creamy, delicious treats. It comes equipped with an outer bowl and lid to house your pint while you're processing. The Creamerizer paddle, which transforms frozen mixtures into perfectly creamy texture, creamy pints and lids to store your delicious creations right in your freezer, and lastly, an inspiration guide with unique recipes to help you get started. I loved reading through all that amazing stuff. If you're looking for more recipe inspiration, have questions about the Ninja Creamy, or want to purchase more creamy pints, visit us at ninjacreamy.com and join our official Ninja Foodie family community on Facebook. Birthday parties, play dates, movie nights. You know how to make these even better? Soft serve ice cream. The new patented SX1000 from Ice Cream Depot is the first and only true soft serve ice cream machine for your home. No bowls to freeze, no running out after one small batch. The SX1000 makes batch after batch of delicious creamy soft serve right on your countertop. Just mix, pour, and in 15 minutes, serve your own soft serve. Then, make more. Plus, cleanup is a breeze and takes just a few minutes. Love fancy coffee drinks? The SX1000 makes easy, nutritious smoothies and frozen frappes in a snap. Party by the pool? Make it the party by the pool with homemade frozen cocktails. Soft serve whenever you want, as much as you want, and no messy cleanup. Best of all, the patented SX-1000 costs just a fraction of a commercial soft serve machine. Order yours today and enjoy delicious soft serve ice cream at home, finally. Do these jingles take you back to the ice cream truck coming around the corner? Now you can easily make your favourite childhood dessert with the Breville Smart Scoop. It's the first compressor ice cream maker with load sensing that lets you set and forget. This banana frozen yoghurt recipe is one of many sure crowd pleasing favourites that are included in the recipe section of the instruction booklet. Place the paddle securely into the 1.5 quart bowl. 
The outside needs to be completely dry or the water can turn to ice and cause it to get stuck. Pour the mixture into the ice cream bowl and place it into the smart scoop. Then choose from the 12 hardness settings. Turn the dial to the right for harder textured dessert like gelato or ice cream and dial to the left for softer sorbet and this frozen yogurt. If you want to tailor to your preferred consistency or for a pre-timed recipe, you can mix in manual mode. The optional pre-cool function can be used before both manual and automatic settings and only takes about 10 minutes to cool. That same button can activate the child lock by holding it down for two seconds. To make it faster, I'm definitely going to press pre-cool. Great for entertaining, the keep cool setting will keep the consistency of the dessert by chilling and churning for up to three hours. There's also an option to switch between Fahrenheit and Celsius. But to alert you to when your dessert's ready, the big decision remains to choose from the jingles, beeps or a mute option. But that doesn't really scream ice cream. Ice cream usually takes about 50 minutes to churn and chill. But if your recipe calls for chocolate chips, fresh fruit or flavourings, there'll be a ding at about three to five minutes just before your ice cream reaches its desired consistency. When it's done, remove blade will flash. Use the included spatula to remove the frozen dessert from the bowl into a freezer container. You can immediately serve or since it's all natural and free from stabilisers and preservatives, it will store for one week in the freezer. To prevent ice crystals from forming, put plastic film directly over the top before storing in the freezer. The bowl should be hand washed. Use the included bottle brush to clean inside of the scraper blade. The Smart Scoop, brought to you by the Food Thinkers of Breville. Hi, I'm Mary Rogers, and this is the Cuisinart Gelateria Ice Cream Sorbet and Gelato Maker. It's beautifully designed, it's really compact, it's so simple and easy to use. Let me show you what comes with your ice cream maker. This is your integrated lid, and inside the lid, this is the removable um, cup. It's also a measure, so it, it goes up to half a cup. And you'll notice it also has um, a little hole here so that as you're adding, let's say, the nuts at the end of the cycle, you can just pour them through that um, little opening right there. This is your paddle, and it's used for all types of ice cream. I'm just going to put this on the side. This is your two-quart freezer bowl, and we recommend that you put this in the freezer at least overnight for the best result. There's your paddle and the lid. Now, on the front of the machine, you'll notice there's several functions. The first is ice cream, the next is gelato, and the last is sorbet. And each one of these um, pre-programmed options runs at a different speed for the optimal results. So first you have ice cream and it will um, come up preset on 25 minutes, but you can adjust this all the way up to um, an hour or down if you prefer. Um, and you just turn it on when you're all done choosing your time. Then you have gelato. It's a preset for 30 minutes. Same thing, just turn it on. You notice for gelato, it turns a little slower. And the last one is sorbet, which it recommended time is 40 minutes. You just turn it on and it stop. It starts. And what will happen is, um, this is so simple and easy to use, it takes all of the questionability out of making these frozen desserts. Um, the great thing about it is it shuts off when it's done and you can just enjoy your ice cream has a beautiful stainless steel finish. It's really nice and compact, and it couldn't be more fun to make ice cream at home. So now what we're going to do is we're gonna put the ingredients together to make an ice cream, and this happens to be um, butter pecan. I'm just gonna put this back in here. And the first ingredient is your milk. So put that in with the, with the sugar and the salt. And then what you're going to do is you're just going to whisk this until the sugar dissolves. And this is really simple and easy to do. This is such a fun thing to do with kids too, to show them how much fun and how simple and easy it, it is to make ice cream. 
The great thing about ice cream, making it at home, you know exactly what type of ingredients go in. If you prefer to use organic milk or organic sugar or um, whatever ingredients you have in your home, it's great. So that's the heavy cream. I'm just gonna whisk that and then whisk in finally the vanilla. Now, normally what we recommend that you do is let this basically come together and let the flavors incorporate. And that takes about two hours or you can leave it in the fridge overnight. But today, because we're gonna be making this immediately, I'm not going to actually do that. So I'm just gonna pour this into this pitcher just so it's a lot easier to get it in the ice cream maker so I don't make a mess. And you can see that the ice cream, the um, sugar was dissolved really well. So what I'm gonna do is take this lid off, pour this inside, And then what I'm going to do is choose ice cream. It's preset on 25 minutes. And I'm going to hit start. And you saw how quickly that came together. In 25 minutes, you can have a beautiful, luscious ice cream. So our ice cream just finished um, churning. And then I just want to mention, um, these happen to be the pecans that we had out earlier. All you need to do is, towards the very end of the mixing cycle, just add these a little bit at a time for some extra taste. And look how beautiful that is. Who doesn't love a cool ice cream any time of year? I know I do. Today it's like 92 degrees out and I'm melting. So I definitely want to taste this and cool off. That's really rich. I like the extra crunch with the nuts. I like nuts in my ice cream. It couldn't be easier to make fresh homemade ice cream with ingredients that you can control right at home with the Cuisinart Gelateria Ice Cream Sorbet and Gelato Maker.